Yeah. Something I talk about is the importance of having people to support you. And yeah. that's been you throughout oh. my life. Through all the little existential crises, yeah. you've been there feeding me snacks. I have. And as annoying as you have been, at least you've been there. Thanks, Dan. That was too positive. We can't end the video like that. Do you ever feel like you don't have a personality? What? Okay, scratch that. Next conversation. <laughs> no, no, it's fine. Just move on. You've got a personality. Do I? Yeah. Is it just not one of the many faces I choose to put on? <gasps> not if you're just like hanging out with me. Like, why would you be putting on a face? Well, do we know each other is the question. I'd like to think, hopefully, kind of well by now. Okay, quick quiz. What colour are my eyes? That is, your eyes are like three colours at the same time. That's a trick question. Yeah, your I'm, eyes are blue, green and yellow. I am very radioactive. <laughs> That's correct, though. Yeah. How you did a great job because you're matching the stormtroopers. Well, look, this is one of the best photos. And your hair looks great as well. Coordinating with the lads. I know. And I picked the outfit for it. You, you the shoes with the white wedge on the bottom of the black. I was a bit jealous of you. I was like, you've done so well with this outfit. You were the Star Wars text in space. I was the text. I, I, <laughs> went, <laughs> I went as the text. But you look lovely. Thank you. I think, honestly, us two stood next to each other. We were the best thing yes. about The Last Jedi. Really I went into action mode. I was like, okay. Dun, 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 dun. No, no, no. And obviously, my first thought was concern for you. Yes. My second concern was why... At why at 2 a.m. Isn't it funny this was the first time that we'd met? This is the first day That's that we've first ever met. day we'd ever met. Your fucking faves could never have this chemistry day one. Day one. Show me your favorite duo. I'll wait. I'll sit the fuck right here. Can you believe it? We'd known each other for 20 four minutes. and a half hours <laughs> and we did this. Why can't two bros just tackle each other? You Everyone's know? like, that was an 11 hour fuck session. I think <laughs> you were just being violent. Oh, Phil's hot. Phil's hot. Can Phil express an opinion? Yes. <laughs> yes. Thank you. I just sorry. Uh, I, doing the, doing I will be sat at a dinner table in a circle with six people, and I'll go. And yeah, that's what I thought when I went there last week. What do you think, Phil? And then everyone in the table will just be looking down at their not, bread. They're not hearing and it. And they'll just they'll just start talking over me, and I will be like, "Am I f dirt?" Imagine like an ambient room right now. Let's do some like. Uh, Oh, here comes Danny starting to talk. Phil actually has to make a point out of saving me and I getting do. me to repeat what happened. I go, what did you just say, Dan? But, oh, Dan, I think Dan just had something to say. Everybody look at Dan. And I'll be like, but, but, I, I, I was just, I, I was just it's saying funny, oh, it's funny thing. And Phil is in his own little world again. <laughs> Don't trip. Hello from the editing zone, Phil, why are you back? Well, first of all, I just wanted to let you know this video was a mistake, there is hair everywhere and it's never gonna go away. Secondly, I just wanted to say how proud I am of Dan and how he's grown into such an inspiring person. And he's so modest about this book and he's not talking about it as much as he should. So here I am to talk about it because it's great. I learned stuff, I laughed, I might have even cried, shut up. But I agree, there's so many things that we need to know to keep ourselves happy. So you shouldn't just get this to support him, you should get it to make yourself that little bit happier. I've just seen how happy he's been since he's found all this out and I want that for you as well. So, I put the link below. He's probably gonna hate me for this, but it's too late now. <laughs> Bye. Um, so now the next video is inspiring me to go on holiday, which is convenient because I am going on holiday this week. Damn you. Going to Florida. You're gonna miss me, Dan. Uh, slightly, maybe. <laughs> A little bit. How are you late? I'm in Bubble Bum. Are you really Bubble Bum? I know how it all works. I got a lot done. It was a very productive night for me. Yeah. A lot of packing. A lot of thinking about how I feel about Phil. <laughs> I crept in so I was like, surely Dan has gone to bed. I just greeted him like that. Well, I mean, look, I was incredibly sympathetic. Yeah. I was also very annoyed and just judgmental of Phil for trying to open super glue with his teeth. I'm never going to live this down. And yet, I was like, you are back. You are alive. <laughs> okay, but... And as I was pottering around, I saw that Dan had left this little message for me. Very helpful, thank you. <laughs> I mean, some might say that was condescending and passive aggressive. I say it was entirely necessary, yeah. considering the circumstance. Definitely. to meet an increase in population. That's so sweet. <laughs> well done. Oh, my contact lens has fallen out. I got so excited. <laughs> what? Oh my god. Let me see. Ah. Hold your top eyelid and look down. 
I think it's just coming. Yes, it's peeling off and it's like going backwards into your brain. Oh. You need to go to the bathroom and you need to take it off right okay, now. Okay, be right back. I was compromised. I won't give up on us, even if the skies get rough. I'm really happening. How do you feel? I feel like my face is gonna fall off. <laughs> Same in a good way. So much work. Mo it's mainly. Into this. Okay. Right. Here we go. Are you ready? Yeah. Fine. Oh, I just saw a little bit. Oh my god. Okay, okay. Oh, this one's all about best friends. Is it? So I dedicate this to you, Phil. Oh. Here is Sherlock. And this is Phil. Ten minutes later. I feel so ill. But you did it, what? Phil. You killed I, the dragon. I'm so happy I killed the dragon. You entertained the people. The room is still spinning. But at what cost? <laughs> Don't look at me. Oh. <laughs> Do I look actually green? Yeah, you look more translucent than usual. No! Is that is that what, is that what you're meant to do? Yes! Supposedly. I'm, I'm thankful for all our audience on you now, right Aww. now. I'm thankful for you, Phil. Aww. Is that what you wanted? <laughs> Phil, it was a complete flop. Oh no. You're dressed. dressed! Well done. I figured if I got dressed, it would make me feel better within myself. And how did that work? Kind of, not really. How is that sweet cough syrup? Ah. Oh, it tastes very herbal. I got moist for you, Phil. Tell me you I'm, like it. I love it. You love it. And I won Creator of the Year. You did. Well done, and Phil. And I shared it with you Aww. in an emotional... And I spent the majority of 2016 with another person, Dan Howell. So I think it's only fair that he comes up here and shares this with me. <laughs> wow. Why can't you see them? I don't know. It's weird. No, I think your personality is too adorable for it. Really? It, it doesn't look right. Since 2009, I think the longest we have ever been apart yeah. is actually two and a half weeks when you went to Florida. No, so is, that, this, is that it? This is about to be dramatic, because guys, I am about to get on a bus to go on tour to America, and beep, I am beep. gone for two and a half months. That's a lot of months. It's literally not a lot of months. No. If you're, if you're talking months plural, it's two. It's so okay, it's technically it's, the least amount it's, of months. It's a lot of seconds. It's several seconds. Yeah. So, so Dan came to see me a few hours later. He brought a care package of some snacks and my Switch. So I wasn't too bored. Said you'll be totally fine and they're just checking you out. Don't worry. Soon you will be back and this will be an extremely silly anecdote. Oh, hey, it's Phil, the blue hey, night. Hey, 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 Phil. Eight super glue. That was great. Look at me being a supportive friend with the double exclamation. Hey, did you miss me? Yes. I'm filming you. Huh? Ah. Huh? Ah. No. <laughs> <laughs> Try. So be like, so the. You got an eyelash. Can make a wish. You've got like a no. <laughs> Just like pruning each other like monkeys. <laughs> Sorry. And this is when, through the magic of the internet, I met Phil. And obviously, we were more than friends, but it was more than just romantic. This is someone that genuinely liked me. I trusted them, and for the first time since I was a tiny child, I actually felt safe. And the relationship we formed at that point was something that I needed in my life. We are real best friends, companions through life, like actual soulmates. Not that souls are a real thing that exists. It's so lucky to just find someone you can be that compatible with. And especially to anyone that has experienced the kind of self-hatred that I've dealt with. One person accepting you can make all the difference.